Hi guys, it's Sam for Digital Meat, and um, this is a, just a very quick, quick tip. Um, and I'm going to be talking about how you can open up multiple instances of Cinema 4D, um, because sometimes you may you may want to, uh, if you've got two screens, you may want to view Cinema 4D side by side so you can compare scenes. So I'm just going to create a box in the middle of this scene, and then open up a new and create a sphere now you can actually flip between those two scenes they're actually open so here we have untitled one that's the box and here we have untitled two and that's just in the window menu so you can do that but what if you want to view these side by side um, that doesn't really help so sometimes you may want two instances of cinema open um, now you'd think that you may be able to come down here and press on this again but it actually does nothing or you go to the executable in the um, Maxon folder and that also does nothing so I'm going to show you how you do it um, what you basically got to do is um, if you go to this PC it's called this PC on Windows 10 I think it's my computer on maybe 7 and 8 not quite sure um, if you want to go to your C drive program files uh, Maxon whatever version you're using and then go down to the Cinema 4D Execute I'm going to right click on that and go to Send To Desktop and then in brackets it says Shortcut uh, Create Shortcut so if I hit that and then close this down Minimize Cinema you'll find that um, we've got the Cinema 4D dot Execute here now clicking on this alone it's not going to open up another version of Cinema 4D it will it will detect that there's already one running and say yeah it's already open so what you've got to do is right click on the Cinema 4D shortcut go down to properties and in there you'll see that we've got this uh, target and that's basically uh, where we just went in the folder which is C program files max on Cinema 4D blah 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 and then the dot execute at the end of this you want to put your cursor right at the end do a space hyphen and then type the word parallel after it and then click apply okay that and then double click cinema 4d so as you can see here, we've got this version open and we've got we've got another version open so now you can have these side by side so you can compare scenes or you know whatever it is that you, you you might want that for so that's how you get it running in parallel two instances I think you may be even able to have another one so look yeah so you can have as many copies as you like running as long as you've got memory you can do that so okay there you go cheers guys thanks for listening uh, don't forget to visit digital me on Facebook Twitter and uh, also you know, the YouTube channel, Vimeo channel, and the webpage, of course, digitalmeat.uk. Okay, cheers, guys. Bye.